Stephen here from History of Hustle, and there we are, back at it again. This time, in the old town of Bucharest, the capital of Romania. In this video, I'm going to talk about how Romania became an independent nation. What is now Romania used to be known as the three principalities of Wallachia, Moldavia, and Transylvania. Now, in the years after the Ottoman conquest of Constantinople in 1453, these three principalities would come under Ottoman control. Transylvania eventually became part of the Austrian Hungarian Empire, and then there was also Russia that took parts of what is now Romania. The 19th century was a century of national awakening. In 1859, Alexander Johann Cusa became the ruler of Moldavia and Wallachia, uniting them into Romania. Now, his reforms brought massive dissatisfaction, and in 1866, he was forced to abdicate. One year later, the Prussian prince, Carol, ascended to the throne. Now, he was still a prince and Romania was still a principality because they were still under Ottoman control. But in 1877, the Russo-Turkish War broke out. And Romania fought side by side with the Russians and the Bulgarians and the Serbians for an independent nation. The Turks sued for peace and at the Congress of Berlin 1878 the map of the Balkan was withdrawn. So the Principality of Romania became the Kingdom of Romania with King Carol I as head of state. More conflicts would follow, for example the First World War. I'm going to talk about that conflict in the next video. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out.